Hey everybody, happy New Year's Eve. Um, to the end of how did this happen? How did we get to be the end of the year? Hopefully you all had a great holiday. When you get on, say hi. We're gonna do, I haven't been on in, gosh, a little bit over a week, I think. The holidays and just crazy life. We're on day two of a snowstorm here in the Northeast and uh, it's crazy. Hopefully it'll stop soon. Um, I think we're on the tail end of it, but 14 inches, you know, it's great for snow days. But we have so many amazing bundles out right now, you guys. And more to come with 2020 coming. But one of the bundles that we have right now, it's called a full circle bundle. And I thought it would be good to, to end on that. I have a new niece and I thought that a cute little plaque for her with her name. I picked this up at Michael's, I think. I threw a, well, I had my husband put some stain on it. And you don't even have to do the back because we're just going to. Put it on the wall um but one of the files in it is this really cute floral wreath i cut it out of glitter i started weeding some of it just to keep it going here um and i've got my Cricut easy mini because i figured it'd be much easier to press on this than to adjust all of the things on my heat press which you can do if you don't have a mini or you don't have a household iron um, and want to use your heat press, you can adjust the heat on it, or the pressure, I'm sorry, the top plate and get a good, you'll be able to do it so that you can get it flat on there in order to get the press that you need for your glitter or for your HTV, whatever you put on it. You could do a stencil on this, um, which I thought about doing, but I thought, let's try HTV, see how it goes. I did try a little piece on the back first and it's it's on there and it looks it's gonna be so fun when it's done um, we probably have a lot of new friends with us today people I've seen tons of people getting makers and explore airs and see cameo fours for Christmas and we're gonna have lots of fun this year but let's make this cute little sign so what I did was I took a couple different colors of glitter because it's a girl and it should be glittery and shiny and just glitter peel uh, weeds peels weeds so easy um, you don't even really need a pick if you roll it you can pick out the little pieces in here which I know I've got a couple circles and you guys can't see what I'm doing. I help, I put my camera up higher today, so I, I'm a little off, but love champagne. Actually, I think this is rose gold glitter, but it's so pretty. And then I used, I think, a jade or a turquoise. I put the link up top um, to our friends at Swing. I've got some mermaid blue um, for... The glitter, I put the link up for the bundle and I put a link up for the mini. Now when I when the mini first came out, I didn't think I wanted one. I love it now. Um, but with this bundle, what I did was I cut her name out. You can do either the name, you can do an initial on this. And when it, we start putting it all together, you'll see these bundle or these files in the Full circle bundle are so much fun. You can make, I've seen out there, I don't know if you, have you guys gotten the Lazy Susans from Ikea? I really want to get one of those. And this bundle would be awesome for those. Or the other thing I've seen are the laundry baskets with, or uh, blanket baskets with the wood rounds on top of the basket with, you know, home and your um, coordinates of your house. So those are the bundle, uh, the full circle bundle has a lot of files in there that would be great on there. So then I cut our name out. That we could have just done the E in here in the circle, but I thought put her whole name in. So I'm going to flip you down and you can 
we'll just put this all together really quick. Um, so I'm going to lay this on. And I'm okay with the green going whichever way. I kind of like it. I like this. So with the mini, and I had a couple comments because I like, I would rub it back and forth like I was ironing. And I guess you really don't have to do that. You just need the pressure to go around. And because this is not a large um, surface, or the mini's not, to press a lot, we'll just go around a little bit each time. So who got machines for Christmas? Who knew machines? Who got craft supplies? For the holidays. I always like, I would love a, a basket or a stock full of vinyl. I think that would be an awesome gift. I'll have to tell my husband that one for next time. Just fill it. Rolls and vinyl. But, again, we've got a lot of files. A lot of awesome stuff. Today is the last day for the December bundle. Um, if you haven't picked that one up yet, not just Christmas files in it, like you would think for um, December, but do that a little more. And so pretty. I don't know if you guys can hear me say that. Look it. Love it. So. The flowers I knocked out because you can't layer glitter on glitter. So I'm just going to make sure that I've got them going the right way, which I think we'll do this one first because oh, you can see which way it's got to go um, by right like that. It'll go right like this. So we'll put this one on first, and I don't need a Teflon because I'm staying right on my carrier sheet for my glitter. If I was going to go over this again, you'd want to put your Teflon sheet down. I made it a little too close to the edge, but that's okay. Don't rub, don't rub, right? I've also had, I made my husband go upstairs, usually... I'm home alone. Well, not alone, but my kids will be home when I'm doing a live. And uh, my husband's home for the break, for breakup from work. And uh, I made him go upstairs while he went live. So I have it all nice and quiet down here. Is everybody crafting today? People working? Are we getting ready for a party tonight? You guys all go out. I think we're going to stay in and just play games. I think that'll be a fun night. The kids love it. So, just piecing it together. And then, put her name in. Like I said before, you can either just do the letter or put a whole name in. And I just picked a font that I had in my library. I couldn't tell you offhand. Um, what font it is. I meant to write it down because I figured people would want to know. But I'll try to remember to link it later. Um, but again, the full circle bundle came out last week, I think. Right before the holiday. And um, super cute files for a lot of house stuff. Monograms, keychains. You can make keychains with the full circle stuff bundle. There's a, some, there's a monogram one in there that are really good if you get the acrylic rounds. You can um, do your uh, keychains up. Even this round, this file on a round would be cute for um, a keychain. I would probably just do the letter. Let's see if that 
keep it enough. There we go. I know it's backwards. Her name is Ellie. So, look at that. So sparkly. I love it. And then you just take some ribbon with this. And I thought I'd make a little hanger. Um, try to... I haven't tried this part yet. But... Probably don't need it that long. Probably about there. I'm going to leave it. I'm going to try to watch the noise. Yep. And we have a hanger. So that was so easy, so quick, so fun. I seriously, I need to put a little uh, nail here so I can hang things up and show you. But again, full circle bundle, file, the links up top, glitter, so fun. You guys have a very happy new year and we will see you soon throughout the year. I won't be back this week. I'll probably be back on next week. New bundles, new files, lots of fun. Check out the blogs. If you guys are new, we have tons of Cricut blogs out there and tutorials and silhouette blogs and tutorials, brothers, and cut. Check out that section on our website and happy new year. Have a great day, guys. Bye.